It began in December 2013 in Meliandu, a remote forest village in Guinea. Two-year-old Emil Wamuno infected his pregnant mother, Sia. Within days, they both died, as did his sister Philomene, followed by their grandmother, Kumba. A nurse became infected, and the village midwife, who was treated at Gekadu Hospital. One of her close relatives travelled to the village of Dandu Pombo, taking the Ebola virus. Six deaths followed here. Someone from Gekadu Hospital fell ill and was treated in Macenta, where a doctor became infected. After the doctor's funeral in Kisidugu, his two brothers died, along with three more people. The virus continued to spread, and on the 23rd of March, the World Health Organization declared an Ebola outbreak in Guinea. A week later, Liberia confirmed its first death. Soon, it spread to the densely populated capital, Monrovia. Sierra Leone investigated, and on the 25th of May, confirmed its first case as the Ebola virus reached the capital, Freetown. A year after the first case, more than 5,000 people have lost their lives in what has become the world's worst Ebola outbreak.